Hey, welcome in everybody. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create other templates. So we've already created a B-size template, and then we've created our own custom-made title block. But there could be some instances where we need a bigger sheet of paper than a B-size. So we might, we, we might want to make different size templates depending on which size sheet that we might need. So the good thing is we already have our, our title block created. So we don't really have to uh, recreate that very much at all. But so we have our, our horizontal or kind of landscape mode B-size sheet. So let's say that we wanted to create a B-size sheet that's um, more vertical or portrait mode that's kind of standing straight up. So I'm going to demonstrate um, one way to do that. So first what you want to do is you want to go to new. You want to open up your... Um, original template that we created. So I'm going to open up my B-size landscape title block. I'm going to hit create. And it asked me, do I want millimeters or inches? I'm just going to leave that. I'm not going to answer that right now because it doesn't matter. I might hit OK. So there is our, um, our template with our awesome title block. So what I want to do now is I'm going to create a new template. So I'm going to go up to File new. I'm going to use the standard drawing um, sheet here like we did. I'm going to hit create. And then I'm going to go up to sheet one. I'm going to right click. I'm going to um, edit the sheet. And I want to make it a B size again, but this time I'm going to hit the portrait. So it's standing up and then everything else is okay. I'm going to click the OK button. So here I would right click on the ANSI, delete that. I'm going to right click on the border, delete that. So then I'm going to go up to my plus over by the drawing resources. I'm going to hit the plus on the borders. For default border, I'm just going to right click, insert drawing border. And then here I'm going to open expand this. I want to make sure that this is uh, all the margins are 0.5 or a half an inch on every side of the paper. I keep doing that. I keep putting two decimals. I only need one. There we go. So there's that. There's that. For the horizontal zones, I'm going to make this. Um, leave that four for the vertical i'm going to make this six and then i'm going to hit okay so there's our border all right so now i want to insert my my new custom title block right so if I, you'll notice if i go up to title blocks here i don't see it like oh my gosh where is it do i got to create it all over again uh no ain't nobody got time for that so I'm going to go back to my original drawing here that I, I opened up first. And then you're going to see, okay, there's the title block that I want. So I'm going to go up to Drawing Resources, click the plus, click the plus next to Title Blocks. And then you see that there's our B-size title block. So I can right-click it. I can copy it. And then I'm going to go back to my new template that I'm working on. And under the title blocks here... I'm going to right click and then I'm going to paste it. So there's our, our B size title block. It's not really a B size. It's just, it's just a title block. So then I can right click, I can insert it. And then I don't care if it's millimeters. I don't care what the units is at this point. I made okay. And you notice it pops it in. So that's all nice and good, but you'll notice that it has like a little gap here. So you, there's nothing really you can draw. In that little gap. So what I want to do is I'm just going to edit this a little bit to where this title block um, kind of expands to this whole side here. So to do that, I'm going to delete this title block here. Make sure you delete under the sheet one. So right click, delete that. And then I'm going to go up to title blocks, B size, 
I'm gonna right click, copy. And then on title blocks, I'm gonna right click, paste. So this is a copy of the, uh, the B size. So this is the one I'm going to, I'm gonna insert it into our sheet here. I don't care about the units. Um, actually, yeah, 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 yeah. Do I wanna do that? Wait, if I may not have wanted to do that. Oh, let me go to right click and edit. Yeah, let me go to edit. All right, here we go. So really all I wanna do on this is, I'm gonna change this from nine to 10. And then everything is fine, except you'll notice that our image is a little bit not centered anymore. So I'm just gonna click on the image and kind of drag it over a little bit. Somewhere like, that's pretty good. Because everything else is dimensioned, it's stuck with the dimension. So when we change the dimension of this width down here, everything's good to go. But we, we, we can't dimension our image, so that one we have to kind of move manually. So then I'm done with that. I'm going to click on Finish Sketch, um, Save here. I'm going to save this as, I'm just going to call this Wide Title Block. Hit Save. And then I'm going to, get, I'm going to delete this copy of the B-size one. I'm going to delete that one. The wide one up here, I'm going to, I want to right click and I want to insert this one. I don't care about the units and you can see it fits up this whole space. So I really don't, I really don't need that, that one there. The copy of the B-size one, I don't need it. So I'm just going to right click, I'm going to delete it. So we have our B size and we have our wide one. So there's that. So then what I can do here is I'm going to go up to file. I'm going to hover over the save as and where you see save copy as template. I'm going to click that. And then this is going to be a B size uh, portrait. Portrait title block. So that lets us know that that one's kind of taller than it is wide. I'm going to hit save. So now we have a, a B-size like horizontal version and we have a B-size vertical version. And then we didn't have, have to redo our, our title block that much for that one. So that's how we make our, our B-size portrait mode um, template. So Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a C size template. And this one, I'm just gonna make it um, landscape mode. We're not gonna do it standing up. So I think for the C size, the C size, I'm gonna use the wide um, title block that we made. So I don't, this drawing here, I can just go to file and close. I know it gets confusing as to what drawing is what. So I'm gonna use this one. I'm gonna create a new Drawing, I'm gonna go to my standard. I'm gonna go to create. I'm gonna go to sheet, right click, edit sheet. This is a C size, which is 22 by 17. I'm gonna leave all that okay. And then we're gonna get rid of our border, get rid of our, and see, we'll get rid of our title block here. So delete that. And then I'm just gonna go to borders here. I'm gonna right click, insert a drawing border. And again, I'm just gonna expand this. I'm just gonna make these all uh, half an inch. I keep doing that. I don't want two decimals. Urgh. That one's good. This one is pretty good there. We got all that, Spot five. The number of zones, and really, to be honest, I'm not sure how many zones we need. So let's say that we need horizontal, maybe, maybe 12, maybe 10. Let's go 10. Looks like it's, yeah, 10 by 12 vertical. Let's try that. Did my hit okay? 
Mm. Mm. I don't know, that looks like a little much, doesn't it? Do, 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 do. Let me think about this. Yeah, let me redo that. So I'm gonna go up to um, default border. I'm gonna delete that. Let's do this again. Let's go to insert. I wanna go, oh, that's good. Number of zones, let's do maybe eight and eight. Eight and eight. I don't really know if it matters, but it's just a visual thing. Hit okay. It looks better. Okay, yeah, so we're gonna go with that border. Then I need to bring in the title block so you can see that we don't have our custom one. So I'm gonna go to my my uh, portrait mode B size and bring this one in. So this one's gonna be wide title block. I can right click, copy, go back to my new template here and I wanna paste it in our title block folder there and then i can just click on here right click insert it i don't care about the units right now there we go so there's our new uh our new custom title block into our our c size sheet but first we need to save our c size template so file hover over save as make sure you save copy as template and then we're going to call this C size, um, C size landscape. We're not going to make a portrait one. So that's really all that we need. I'm going to hit save. So there we go. So I don't think we need anything bigger than that right now. So, I mean, if you want to make a D size, you could, but I think we're good here. So we got B size horizontal and vertical and we have our C size. There we go. So yeah, just make sure you do that. Make sure you save it as a template and we'll be good to go. All right, peace out.